Two teams ready, they hope, to clear the final hurdle, the final Europa League hurdle. And the atmosphere is building up already. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. Well, the anticipation is over, and now the big day is here. It's the final of the UEFA Europa League. I'm Derek Ray, and as always on these big occasions, I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and England defender Stuart Robson. We're on the cusp of kickoff. It's Arsenal up against Sporting. Well, Derek, this should be a top-class game between two excellent teams. Whoever gets control of that midfield area should win the game, but I think this is too close to call. And this is the Arsenal starting 11. Aaron Ramsdale is the goalkeeper. Granit Xhaka plays with Thomas Partey in central midfield. And the main striker here is Edward Nketiah. Here's the lineup for Sporting. Well, they're playing with a 5 2 3, as we can see it here. But somebody has to step in to join those two midfield players. It could be one of the fullbacks or it could be one of the centre halves. So keep an eye out for that. It is the Europa League final. And they are underway. Kevin Cow. Marcus Edwards. Bayerine. Could be. Oh dear, not really troubling the goalkeeper at all, Stuart. Well, from that range, he should be scoring, and he knows it. the corner played into the box not quite the clearance they were hoping for well showing excellent judgment to intercept well you never quite know who's going to emerge from the shadows and become a match winner but this man might be a decent shout what are you expecting to see from him, Stuart? Well, Derek, he's a great all-round player, but it's his ability to run in behind defenders that makes him such a threat. Oh, wait, Stuart, they might score! Oh, a goal! To put Arsenal in front on this massive occasion! And how significant could that be in the grand scheme of things here? Well, it's a very simple finish in the end, but his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most. So, underway again here. One nil the score. This could square the game, but the keeper has his say, and 
how important could that be in the grand scheme of things? Well, that was a big chance, and really, he should have taken that. But let's give credit to the goalkeeper. It's a decent save. Now, sending it in. Body in the way. Well, no real accuracy, and easy for the keeper. Well, not the pass he had in mind. And Kessia. And promising stuff from Arsenal. Well, they're keeping their opponents moving and guessing. Real chance. And there it is. A two-goal cushion now. And just look at these fans. The trophy coming their way, surely. Well, I'm sure the replay will confirm he got a touch on this, which he does. So he'd be really upset that he didn't keep it out. So underway once more, 2-0 the lead here. Ben White. It's with Erdogan. Arsenal couldn't keep the ball. Kevin Cow. A oh, terrific pass, and he's in. Well, he was on his own, but couldn't take advantage of it. Well, I'm not surprised he missed that. He never really looked in complete control, did he? Good pass. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. On attacking possibilities. And the cross not quite imaginative enough. Now the delivery. Well, he was being closely watched. Goal kick. Well, the defender knew he couldn't get to the ball first, but he just did enough to put him off there. Well, as you can see, Arsenal have had most of the ball. Yes, they've played well when going forward, but it's been their ability to regain the ball which has made them so hard to play against here, and it makes them such a good team. It's been a brilliant performance so far. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Saka. And attempting the through ball. Oh, but cutting it out in the nick of time. Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. And a goal! Wonderful stuff as they accelerate away from the opposition.
Well, as the replay shows, it all started with that perfectly weighted ball over the top of the back line. And then just look at the finish. That's a brilliant volley. Good technique and the perfect contact. Well, you've got to say, an incredible first-half performance. That scoreline tells you all you need to know. Martin Odegaard. Nkessia. Now with Sinchenko. Xhaka. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. And just failing to bend the run enough. And the flag has been raised. Martin Odegaard, decent position, poor pass. Pedro Gonzalez, no chance for him to get in behind maybe. Just unable to take advantage of that developing situation. Bukayo Saka. White. Oh, great defending. Pedro Gonzalez. It's with Nuno Santos. Determined defending. Can they hit on the break? Well, far from the ideal pass, you've got to say. Bukayo Saka. Nkesia. Showing a lot of guile there. Oh, fine stop. They favoured a short one here. And making his move inside. Still trying to make something happen. And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. The quest for Europa League success. And the second half of this final is underway. Long-range effort. Well, closed down straight away. Read it superbly to take back possession. This might have potential. This looks promising. Can he take the chance? Well, here's the goal again, and what a wonderfully weighted pass this is. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace, the keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. So they get the ball moving again. 3-1 the scoreline here. What's going to happen next? Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Can he find the right pass? Opportunity here. Oh, terrific save. Well, you're absolutely right. That's a top-class save. Just look how he reacts.
He's driven in the corner. Well, it still could be dangerous. Oh, cleared off the line. Alert defending. Paulinho. Well, a good tackle. Arsenal pushing forward with options available. Can he make it count? Able to clear the danger, at least for now. Only well, one possession back. What can they do from here? Takes aim. And able to close down the shot. It's there for him. And saved by the keeper. Now sending it in. Well, too close to the goalkeeper to really pose a threat. Manuel Ugarte. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Bellerin. Well, tremendous block. And Kessia. Gabriel Martinelli. And Ketia has it. Martinelli. Could be. Oh, a smart stop. And the short option preferred. Arsenal's free kick here. A short free kick this time. Surely! And he's done well to tip it over the bar. An Arsenal corner. And over it comes. And a goal! What a magnificent display! It's such a one-sided contest here. Well, here it is again. It's a good delivery from the corner, and it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. Well, on they go again. Arsenal very much in charge. It's turning into a right old thrashing. He's got the right idea with that pass. Xhaka and keeping it out. Substitution time it is here. Going short. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Twenty minutes remaining. And he keeps going. And still a chance. Bellerin. Well, able to close down the short. And a good save. Well, it is a good save. The idea was good, the execution wasn't. And 
Can they create something? But mistimed his run. Well, he's got the timing all wrong there. He just needs to bide his time. Fifteen minutes left for play. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. Who can he pick out? Able to get a body in the way. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Do they have the guile to up and up the defence? Looked like an effective counter-attack, but brilliantly read. Trossard. Oh, big opportunity! In it goes! Such a complete performance! Four in front now! Well, just look at his strength here. He holds off the challenge, he keeps his balance, and he finds the back of the net. It's a wonderful goal. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Pedro Gonzalves Trincao and a throw in for Sporting now they're going to alter things here's the substitution Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, not quite the ideal delivery. And they're trying to get right into his face. An awful lot of green space to run into. And well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. Now well, we're underway again, and this game was finished as a contest a long time ago. Nuno Santos. Very quick thinking there. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Marcinelli. And back with Trossard. It is now with Jorginho. Can he make it count? There it is! A fantastic goal. And no wonder he's off celebrating. Well, here's another look, and you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal.
Marcus Edwards. It's with Nuno Santos. And there's the whistle. This UEFA Europa League final has been decided. And my goodness, they deserve it. Disappointment on one side, but sheer jubilation on the other.